Rescue Mission off Brighton. A record number of South Australians are under mortgage stress. That's the disturbing finding in a new report which reveals nearly 100,000 households are struggling to make ends meet. But the experts say there is hope and people can find a way to get on top of their home loans. For families across Adelaide, keeping on top of the monthly mortgage is a constant juggle. Yeah, it can be very stressful. We managed to get the bills ticked off, but um, as far as any extras, uh, not really happening. There are now 92,000 South Australian households in mortgage stress, according to the most recent housing finance report. Many of these people are young families who bought relatively recently. This map highlighting the suburbs under mortgage stress, with the areas in blue filling at the most. More than 4,000 households in Salisbury and Paralawi are under pressure. Another 3,000, mostly families, are in a similar position in Andrews Farm, Blakeview, Craigmore, One Tree Hill and Smithfield. They've got um, significant outgoings, so their cost of living are continuing to rise. While in the city south, there are around 2,700 households in Morford Vale and Woodcroft feeling the strain, with 145 properties at risk of default. Tammy Barton from My Budget says often home loans are set right on the threshold of what people can afford, but adds families can turn things around. People can get out of the situation and can get out of the mortgage stress. She says the first thing to do is to face up to your financial difficulties, draw up a budget, cut non-essential spending and talk to your bank, particularly about reducing your interest rate. There certainly are interest rates in and around that 3.5% at the moment, but it really comes down to each individual's financial position. The experts say that the best advice they can give home buyers is to set their budget at an amount well above the minimum loan requirement. An extra percent or whatever is affordable because that way they'll be ahead in their financial position. James Wakelin, Nine News.